Jair, thanks very much. Across the nation, there is a shortage of 911 dispatch operators. In Midland, the shortage for dispatchers is putting a strain on those who are currently doing the job. Shortages in dispatchers can cause delays in people receiving help in their most critical moments. And those that are calling 911 don't have the time to sit and wait on the phone to get help. CBS 7's Tyler Poglich met with Midland dispatchers to learn more about what a typical day is like for them and how the shortage is affecting them. When you dial 911, in a matter of seconds, somebody's answering your phone call with saying, 911, what is your emergency? But what if when you called 911, it went to a voicemail or it just kept on ringing? Midland 911, what's the address of your emergency? Every day, over 200 calls come into the Midland Public Safety Communication Center for 911. Just last year, the Communication Center dispatched over 90,000 calls. Out of those 90,000 calls, dispatchers had to make sure our first responders were aware of the emergency. In 2022, Midland dispatchers notified Midland Fire Department 19,854 times. The Midland County Sheriff's Office was just over 24,000 times and MPD was at 45,832 times. But the number of calls that dispatchers receive, which can be either a 911 call or an administrative call, can be overwhelming all while being understaffed. It is, yes. Right now is one of the worst times that we've ever seen. Lori Gavia has been with Midland Dispatchers for nearly two decades, and over those two decades has come to realize that although being a dispatcher can be very stressful, it is also a very rewarding job to help those in need when they are dealing with an emergency. But right now, Midland dispatchers are dealing with their own emergency, not having enough workers. Um, as far as just um, like the people that are on shift work, you know, have to work a lot of their days off and just mandatories and stuff like that. So when you're fully staffed or at least more staffed, then um, you can enjoy a day off. When there's a shortage in dispatchers, that can mean that sometimes your call doesn't get answered immediately. Um, but some people um, are upset that you didn't answer the phone or, you know, don't understand that um, there's only X amount of people that can answer the phone and then all the phones light up at once. Now, there's no indication why there is a national shortage in dispatchers. It's believed that it can be because of the hours for the job, working holidays, or not being able to spend time with your family. The city of Odessa reports it just hired three new dispatchers and are looking for about five more. If you or someone you know is interested in being a dispatcher, you can check the Midland or Odessa websites for job openings. Reporting in Midland for CBS 7 First Alert News, I'm Tyler Poglich.